Ah, yes. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. This is Harpercepticeye Player here, and welcome back to Undertale. We left off with Flowey giving us, like, like are you gonna kill anyone and stuff? So now we go in here. Da -na -na. Undertale by Toby Fox. <laughs> okay. Keep dreaming and dark scheming. Yeah, you do. <sighs> huh? There's a camera hidden in the bushes. Oh boy, that's lovely. Mm -hmm. Do 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 do. It's a tough looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. Aww. It's been smashed like it was nothing. Yeah, that's not good. That's the opposite of good. That's bad. Everything. No. No. Uh, can't move. <laughs> oh my god, I hate how slow he walks. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. That made him sound emo. <laughs> I'm not. <clears throat> <coughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anyone. Anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thing. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. And what are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. <clears throat> Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend? I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a lot, a ton of work done today. A uh, skeleton. Sans, come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. <sighs> Why does? Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Whoa, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. <laughs> ah, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> Heh. 
<laughs> Jesus. That was probably horrible. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. What's the holdup? Look, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. Well? Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Okay. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. Well, it's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish in sitting inside. Hmm. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Alright, yeah, we got a box. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same... Both... Uh, the same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Use the box? Yes. So we're gonna put the donut, the bandage, and that, and that in here. Because I don't want to waste any of this. I want to sell the tough glove, the bandage, and the toy knife to Temmie. Let me get there. It's a fishing rod. Affixed it to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. You send the line back out. It's probably for the best. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> so, as I was saying about undying, huh? <laughs> Sans! Oh my god! Is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Ow. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is. Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! <laughs> Sons, I finally did it! Undying will... I'm gonna... I'll be so popular, popular, popular! <clears throat> human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what come, what's next. In any case, count continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. What? Oh, this is Alpha. <laughs> Ah, uh, oh my god, help. I'd like to order a, uh, um, a pizza? With, uh, the toppings are, uh, I have them copied. I'll just paste them to you. Your phone is too old to receive text. It reads out loud, character by character, an A-S-A-S-C-I-I -I art of an anime cat girl. Uh, click... Okay, <laughs> what? Ah! Joke. You make a bad ice pun. <laughs> nice try. Oh my god. Snow Drake realized its own name is a pun and is freaking out. Better not snowflake out. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Ah! 
Uh, laugh. You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. See? Laughs! Dad was wrong! Well, could you stop attacking me? I just laughed at your pun! Twelve gold! Oh. Ah, ah. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Note, not yet a very royal guardsman. <clears throat> Absolutely. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, no. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was to mo moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Pet. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Pet. Born, born. You pet Doggo. What? I've been pet. Pat, 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 pat. <laughs> what? Doggo has been pet. You won. You earned zero XP and thirty gold. Yay! S -s -s something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Mm. Hello? Is anybody there? No? <laughs> Someone's been smoking dog treats. Smoke weed every day. <laughs> hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move, and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it... Oh, here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red. So imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Remember, blue stop signs. Okay. Ah! North, ice, south, ice, west, ice, east, Snowden Town, and ice. <laughs> Jesus. Hello. Hello. I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please pick a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. Yay! Yay! You're so lazy! You were napping all night! Uh, I think that's called sleeping. Excuses! Excuses! Huh? Ho ho! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the maze of this, or when you touch the walls of this maze, almost messed that up, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because... The amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. <clears throat> okay, you can go ahead now. Oh. <laughs> Sans, what did you do? Uh, I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Oh my god. I'm scared. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, 
sounds. You will surely be con confined, founded. Oh. I know I am. <laughs> he just fucking what? Hey, thanks. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Is it Ellie? Oh, this is the same thing. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 G. Yes. Here you go. Have a super duper day. We got the nice cream. Uh. Nice cream heals 15 HP. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. Aww. Oh. <coughs> Woo! Okay, we're gonna do it. Small. That is just espresso. Huh? Oh, I shouldn't go there. I should probably go talk to Sam. What? She loves broccoli. I know. Oh, she's a well, she, she probably is a chipmunk. <laughs> well, I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just 5G. Did I say 5G? I meant. 50G. No. You're right. That's still too low. Jesus, Sans. Oh. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell? S snowman. White rating. Can become yellow rating. <laughs> Sus unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green. That's red. Rating. Destroy at all costs. But just saying. Oh, yeah, yeah. Human! I hope you're ready for. Uh, Sans! Where's the puzzle? It's right there. On the ground. Trust me. There's no way they can get past this one. Sans, that didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have went used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that easy peasy word scrap? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable! Human, solve this dispute! Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Jumble. Ha ha! Yes! Humans must be very intelligent. If they also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got dumped trying to solve the horoscope. Aww. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. <laughs> Papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> Jesus. I got the mouse! Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, 
It fills you with determination. Warning, dog marriage. Okay. Uh, oh. Lesser dog appears. Pet, you barely lifted your hand and lesser dog got excited. <laughs> you lightly touched the dog. It's already overexcited. Pat, pat! <laughs> Okay, that- that scared me. <laughs> you pet the dog, it raises its head up to your hand- to meet your hand. <laughs> oh! Lesser dog is barking excitedly. You pet the dog, it was a good dog. Excited noises. <laughs> oh my god, how did I dodge that? You pet the dog. Its excitement knows no bounds. Excited noises. Oh god. Curricular pet dog excitement increased. Excited noises. You have to jump to pet the dog. <laughs> Reverend. <laughs> what? You don't even pet it, it gets more excited. Plane take off. <laughs> what? There is no way to stop this madness. Get out of the cell. What? Lesser dog shows no signs of stopping. Lesser dog enters the realm of the clouds. Oh my god. You call the dog, but it is too late. He cannot hear you. Far away bark. Or. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Oh no, it's coming down. You can reach Lesser Dog again. Bark! You pet Lesser Dog. <laughs> you pet Lesser Dog. Lesser Dog is lowering. You pet Lesser Dog. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god, this dog. I think he. Oh my gosh. Wait, what? It's possibly that you may have a problem. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, it could be. Okay. I think it's I think it's time to end the madness. <laughs> There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Whee! <laughs> yeah, we found it. X marks the spot, baby. Oh no. Da -da -da. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify yourself! Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Roll around. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Number two. Oh. Okay. Okay. <gasps> ah! Oh my god. We sniff. The dog sniffed you again. After rolling around in the dirt, you smell like. You smell alright. What? It smells like a. Are you actually a little puppy? No, 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 no. Ah. Oh. Don't touch hot my hot dog. He means me. Oh. 
the dogs think that you may be lost puppy, okay? Uh, pet. You pet dog Amy. Wow, pet by another pup! Well, don't leave me out. Oh my god, why are you really going faster? Alright, dog Aressa. Pet. You pet the dog Aressa. What about me? A dog that pets dogs. Amazing! Okay, never mind. Expanded. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Little do they know. Oh. Turn every X to an O, then press the switch. I wonder who made this puzzle. Ah! What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Left it. Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home-cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> my brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> Yo, man! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Okay, well. He just slid. I don't know how I feel about that papyrus. Hmm. Ah! No! I didn't... Hmm. Oh my god, Papyrus, I do not know. Hold on. Okay. Um... Okay, wait. Hold on. No. Ah. Uh. I didn't! No! Oh my god. How do I do it? More importantly, how am I supposed to do it? Okay. Oh. Are you serious? Am I that dumb? Oh my god. <sighs> there we go. Wow! You solved it! And you did it all without my help. Incredible. I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Sans! Good jobs on solving it. Ah, uh, Lila. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing 
absolutely nothing. Really? Okay, is that all? Oh, it is. Just have to make sure. Huh? Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles, uh, no, tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the, papara the, the, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Of course. I don't want to be so much. Great. Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready. Uh-oh. Bruh. <laughs> you just disco balls away. <laughs> Actually- Oh god. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier? It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up next year, he'll even make something edible. <laughs> oh my god. On the floor inside is a box of Pomeranians. Aware of dog. Please pet. Please pet dog. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. A dog just rushed in here filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more excited about this sculpture. Its neck got longer and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. That is rather sad. Where's the dog? Seems like the base of a snow dog. Oh my god. Oh, that's a lightning bolt. Okay. Yeet. 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 Wow. Barbed wire made of pipe cleaners. That's a little better. Ah! Hey, 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 I'm helping you! I'm helping you! You remove the box of un do non dog related raisins. That's a little better. Which one? Ah! 
to try to slightly less your team. You remove a childhood photograph of Snow Drake and his parents. Oh, that's sad. The weight has been lifted. Snow Drake. Oh, God. Gift Trot's problems have been taken away. It's a door. I'm wondering if like Toby found like I'm wondering if Toby Fox actually put like a secret to actually open up this door. I don't know. That would have been cool. Like I don't know. I'm not following you. Oh, hold on. Be right back. Had to let my dog in. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. What a tiny dog house. Woof! Okay. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold, a snow puff. Eh, there's 30G inside this? What is this? It's a snow puff, my guy. Like, pfft. Oh no, where's my drink? <laughs> oh my. It's the greater dog. I just wanted a drink, man. Beckon. You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Mm. Hey! Bad dog. Uh, pet. Greater dog curls up in your lap as you, it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. <laughs> then it wakes up. It's so excited. Mm. Well, wow. monster candy. You ate the monster candy. You recover 10 HP. No bark. No barking. Bad dog. Play. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It's splats on the f ground. Greater dog picks up all of the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Mm. God damn it. Mm, pet. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your movements, your movements slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Mm. God damn it. Mm. Stop. You're just great. You can recover 15 HP. Mm. God damn it! Pet. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Oh my god. Stop barking at me. Wait a minute, did Frisk smile? Wait, did you smile? Did you- you smiled. Oh no. <laughs> Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the... Go- Go- of t deadly terror. I can't remember. I can't remember how to pronounce that. Why is there a dog there? That's not deadly. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire. Spikes will swing. Blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. 
Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, may be too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. And it, away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This has... This was another decisive victory for Papyrus? Yeah. Heh. Huh? Hmm. Flowey! What are you doing there? I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Will do, Sans. Snowden! Welcome to Snowden. Ba -ba 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 -ba. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Ready in the shop. Hello, Traveler. How can I help you? I'm gonna make her Australian, the best I can. Care to chat? Hey, yeah. Uh, welcome to Snowden Town. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What to do here? You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Grilby's ha has food, and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right, it's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do the thing. There's two of them, brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the cur caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided to decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages. So, unless you're a ghost or can bury burrow under the door, forget about it. Life here, life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? True that. Take your time. Uh, I don't want the manly banana. I like the ribbon. But I will buy. <laughs> oh god, that was my drink. I got slurpy. Um. It's my own recipe. Okay. Sorry, I just knocked the mic. Bye now. Come again sometime. Use the box? Yes. I'm gonna put the snow piece and the manly banana there. 
Uh, oh, so, uh, stat. How much? Gold. I have one gold. Oh, Jesus. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Is it my little cinnam cinnamon? Just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee hee! Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath the decorated tree. Hey, yo! You're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt! This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics! The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm, I don't want to see the... Irish... Wait, what? Of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip onto their butts. Oh. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with the fish. My god. What the f <sighs> Those dogs are part of the royal guard. The Ellen Ellen I think military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. What the f- I'm thinking of getting a spiked collar to show off my personality, like- It's a big statement, like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. That's more like, I'm gonna beat your ass. <laughs> you, you better watch where you sit here. Uh, you better watch where you sit. Uh. <laughs> you better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. I almost said affection. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. Hmm? Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> what? No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help, I want new drinks and a hot guys. That's your own problem. Jesus. <laughs> everyone is al everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness. Crowding. Lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not fun very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morals about it? Mm -hmm. Let's play monsters and humans! You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? Ah, to be young again. The world, the world sure felt boundless. Ah, oh, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patient award, my patient rewards me. <laughs> ah. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> Bruh. What you doing? Okay. <laughs> Welcome to the library. Yes. We know the sign is misspelled. I know. That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Hmm. Oh my. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Look inside? Yes. It's empty. That's so sad. It's locked. It's locked from the inside. Oh, okay. Ba -ba -ba -da -da. Human. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like... The joy of finding another pasta lover. The adm admiration for another's puzzle solving skills. The desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very... I am very great. Don't ever wonder. Don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not. You shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your. No, no, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Hold on. Ah. Powerful, popular, pre... prestigious? I think. I'm so bad at my words. <laughs> That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Papyrus blocks the way. Flirt. What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? W well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. <laughs> I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all of my standards! <laughs> I, <can laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date l later, after I capture you. Hmm. Um. Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Oh no! Let's date l later after I capture you. Is it? Wow, Papyrus. This is so wonderful. Papyrus is thinking about what to cook for his date. So, you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my fable blue attack. This is easy. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh here we go. Oh. Hmm, I wonder what I should wear. Eh. 
Papyrus Dubs. What? Marinair? Sauce behind his ear? What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Oh my god! Ah! The sounds of terror. Papyrus steps. Metaton brand. Bishi cream behind his ear? What? Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Oh, Jesus, Papyrus. Oh my god. Oh, he. He! Papyrus! Papyrus steps. Metaton brand. Anime powder behind his ear. Why are you dabbing so much shit behind your ear, man? I can almost taste my future pop popularity. <laughs> Yay! I did. Ah! Holy crow! Papyrus, you jump scared me. Papyrus steps. Metatom brand cute juice behind his ear. Papyrus, head of the royal god. Oh my god. Papyrus stabs Metaton brand of attraction slime behind his ear? What? Papyrus unparal- what? Ah! Oh man! Ah! Papyrus stabs Metaton brand beauty yogurt behind his ear. What the hell? You eat the cinnamon bunny. Your HP was maxed out. A dying will be really proud of me. Oh man, oh my god. Oh my god, I'm jumping too soon. Papyrus realize, realizes he doesn't have ears. Understandable. The king will trim my sh <laughs> I almost said a shed. <laughs> This king, <laughs> the king, <laughs> will trim a hedge in my face, <laughs> in the shape of my face. Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. My brother will, well, he won't change very much. Whee! Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. I'll have lots of admirers, but... Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Papyrus whispers, Nyehehe! <laughs> Will anyone like me as sincerely, as, as sincerely as you? I think I'm saying that right, but who knows, my tongue is just weird. Oh my god, please don't. Oh my god, why'd you move? Please tell me that's all. Papyrus is rattling his bones. You eat the cinnamon bunny. Your HP was maxed out. Someone like you is really rare. Oh man. Oh man. Hey, hey, yo. Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. And dating might be kind of hard. Ah. Uh -uh. I didn't mean to move. Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. Okay. After I you're captured and sent away. <gasps> oh my god. Papyrus is rattling his bones. I'll be fine, right? Ugh. Who cares? Give up. Cinnamon bunny, your HP was maxed out. Give up or face my special attack. Hmm. Paris is trying hard to play cool. Okay. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Hmm. Hmm. Paris is cackling. Not too long, and I will use that special attack. Woo! Papyrus is rattling his bones. 
This is your last chance before my special attack. Oh my god. I did it! Oh my god, no I didn't. Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Okay. Behold, my special attack! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Hmm. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Papyrus is getting ready for a regular attack. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack. Ah! Oh my god. Cool. Dude. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my, I did it. <laughs> well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I could see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now is your chance to accept my mercy. Papyrus is sparing you. Oh my god. Oh no, I knocked the mic again. Oops. No ho ho. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be so... Oh, wait. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends. What a loser. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess I guess I can make an allowance for you. Well, we, we haven't even had our first date, and I'm, I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> Who knew that all I needed to make pals <laughs> was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the cab capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through anything can enter through it but nothing can exit except someone with a powerful soul like you that's why the king wants to acquire a human he wants to open the barrier with the soul power then us monsters can return to the surface oh I almost forgot to tell you to reach the exit you will have to pass through the king's castle the king of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> What? What happened? Papyrus. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go save. <laughs> the side of the ant tells you with determination. Yay! Okay, uh, I still have one gold. So, you came back to have a date with me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you somewhere really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
wonder where we're going. <sighs> My house! <laughs> oh, jeez. Welcome to... What? Centic? Centic? Welcome to Centic, my house. Enjoy and take your time. You, the, you touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20G. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, Metaton. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in spr sprinkles. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it anytime. My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with a uh, sugary non-egg substance. How absurd. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please. Pre-use my... Color art show? I can't- I'm really bad with my words. My brain's like, what? Like fucking Patrick. Half of the fridge is filled with containers, all labeled spaghetti. The other half can the other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Okay. <laughs> it's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Fuck, get it. Impressed. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. Um. What? Catch that meddling canine! Curses. Sans! Stop! Pl <laughs> Stop plunging my. L <laughs> Stop plunging my life with <laughs> incidental music! <laughs> A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in my life. Bones? Okay. <laughs> the door is locked. That's my room. If you've finished looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when, they're, when they date. Go inside? Yes. Oh, wow. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? No. Take your time. I'll wait for you. The, e the internet. I'm quite popular there. Quite, quite popular. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besinged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. I wonder who it is. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me, sometimes. Look inside the closet. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. That, that book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle constructions for critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. What? The ending always gets me. Okay. <laughs> what? Ah, yes. Action figures. 
a great reference for the for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! Oh my god. Isn't that flag neato? A dying found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world? Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. We have a skeleton inside of this papyrus. Yeah, ha ha! So technically, do we descend from skeletons? Because we have a skeleton inside of us? Maybe. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind, <laughs> wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. You don't have skin and you don't have hair. I'm sorry, man. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Begin the date? Yes. Okay, dating start. Dating start. Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry. I can't you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. Yeah, true. I snagged an an official <laughs> Dating rule book from the library. We're re we're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one: press press your controller's triangle button for dating hub. Wow, we! I feel so informed. <laughs> I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem. Human, I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. Really? R really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Oh no. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That ribbon in your hair. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No! Could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes. <laughs> oh no! No! You planned it all along! Oh, if you planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. No! no. You're dating... Your dating power. Nyeh. <laughs> Nyeh. Nye Don't think you've be bested me yet. I, the great papyrus, have <laughs> have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. You said you haven't went on a date. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Again, Papyrus, you said you've never been on a date. Behold! Yeah. What do you think of my secret style? I love it. No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> His face. However... You don't truly understand the, the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't accelerate, accelerate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Human soul, souls are stronger than monster souls. But the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. There's no secret <laughs> to my legs. Just hard work and... Uh, 
Okay. The shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing art article articles can be improved this way. My hat? My hat! My hat! <laughs> well, well, then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present j just for you. Open it. Do you know what it, this is? Of course. Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh so wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an... Artrisons work. Silk and spaghetti finely aged in an oaken cat. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face <laughs> reflex reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extensions, and by extensions me, maybe even more than I do. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? Uh, oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that, because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But, alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I just... I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No! Wait! That's wrong! I can't fail at anything! Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend, and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you, because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you s settle for second best. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me any time. Well, gotta go. Ah. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay. <clears throat> All the way over to just say. Okay. Alrighty. So that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed the this Undertale series, as you know. I've you know, you, you know, I hope you enjoy it because, you know, it's nostalgic and all that. So, yeah. 
I will try and uh, upload a FNAF uh, video. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy and have a good day, night, wherever you live. And bye-bye, guys. Bye.